Board. Ahead of the forthcoming nationwide protest, a coalition of civil society organizations operating under the Coalition of Genuine Civil Society Organizations and Rights Activists has urged President Bola Tinubu to take appropriate measures to prevent the continuation of the process. This statement was made during a press conference at Ijai in the Fako Ijai local government area on Tuesday in Lagos State. The coalition affirmed its decision to proceed with the planned protest due to the prevailing hardship in the country, despite not being the primary organizers. Representing the coalition, Comrade Declan Ihekari from Activists for Good Governance stated that the organizers of the protest had provided the Tinubu administration with ample notice regarding the planned demonstrations. Legal State Governor of Wadi you met with some so called civil society organizations, CSOs, and personalities over the plan End Bad Governance in Nigeria, peaceful protests, slated for August 1st to 10th. We wish to let the whole world know that these so called CSOs do not represent the S bad governance in Nigeria protest. As such, the plan to use them to disorientate, destabilize, and demobilize the planned peaceful protest has failed woefully. While noting that it is too late to stop the exercise from holding, Ike Kare pointed out that President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's administration should be blamed for failing to take the right steps to halt the process. He explained that in case the rally went violent, the government should be blamed, alleging that in most past cases of protests that went violent, the government had been found wanting. We learned a lot from instance and we want to also advise the Inspector General of Police to ensure that coordinating coordinate the affairs of all the State Commission of Police, the area commanders, the DPOs, that is true, they will be on ground. And then Nigerians, to Nigerians, thank God for the power of social media. We all have uh, mobile phones, multi-dimensional camera phones. Let us all make use of it to cover all events at every places, at everywhere, at every corner. We will be interested to see the faces of people that will unleash terror on the pride, especially in Lagos State. For the major thing that we are seeing as a threat to them, which is our job, is that we want to make the world know our pain. But they felt that you know, it would be destructive for them, for the world to know our pain. I don't know for today in this country, in this Nigeria, no household has not felt the impact of what we are talking about. You are saying hunger. And if we truly we know, if we truly we mean and we know what our hunger is. What I am saying is that the protest is that a peaceful protest and nobody should recall it to be a violent protest. And is allowed as a shrine in our constitution. Mr. President, you respect Nigerians for that. And don't forget, he was a master protester. I remember when we were still scoring during, during uh, uh, the reclaiming of Agola's mandate. We were all on the back, I mean, at the back of the team, with Mr. Deborah, Mr. President, we were all there together, I was very small then. And so for him now, that taught us how to protest, to use protests to, to, to send our messages. Coming to tell us now. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.